Welcome to Beit Yaquan. Good morning on this wonderful Sunday, 27th of December, 2009. We are taking back now to 1990 and some words of the Spirit which may be of encouragement to you in the body of Christ. Uh, this is the word of the Spirit, number five, and it was after I was unwilling to receive the word. I, I was receiving these words and I was wondering where are these words coming from? So I was unwilling to receive them. But then the word came. And the word came. Eddie, I forgive you because I love you. It is out of this love I will feed you, so that you are not to worry about eating and drinking, for I am in complete control of all things. Just seek my face. Do not hold back from seeking me. I will show you the delights of this world and the next, that you may know what I have in store for my people. They will enjoy themselves greatly in that place. Lots of food for their healing, lots of resolution for their souls to keep on the straight way. I have loved you, says Yahweh, with an everlasting love, and my fire does not stop burning, but burns continually, that you may be remembered before me, as the continuous sacrifice occurred among the Jews, that they would remember who they were in me. So I would have your light burning morning and evening, that know that others, that to others, they would see it and think of me. Hold not back from preaching the word. I will give you fruit. Here am I and the children Yah has given me. We are signs and wonders in Israel. You will be able to say on that day. So fight on. Keep running. Speak, speak, speak. Believe with all your heart, mind, soul and strength that I have called thee as a messenger of my covenant to turn away from unrighteousness to the righteousness of Yehoshua, the Mashiach, Jesus the Christ. Though until now you have been, as it were, a barren fig tree, from now on you will be a fruitful vine or a fruitful branch issuing forth from Yahuwah. Do not hold back, but run. Trust me, hold on to me, and you will see how much I will do to bless you. See if I want to open the windows of heaven and pour my blessing out upon you. You are in truth my servant. Though you wander away willfully, I have made provision for your transgressions, and I will wash you clean with my own blood that you may be before me blameless and righteous on that day when we meet face to face. On that day blessings will flow in a river of delights, wherein the children of God will swim and enjoy the blessed presence of the Father and myself. They will eat and be satisfied. Thirst will no longer afflict their souls, but the waters of eternal life will be that which they drink. Heaven will be open and free of the bondages of this earth. No more earthquakes, crying or pain, but laughter in the presence of God and His holy ones, the angels, laughter and joy. They will roar as when one mighty army has won a victory and celebrates. No more drunkenness from, but, from wine, but joy from the Holy Spirit will fill my children. No more hopeless days, but hope all satisfied in the river of delight. Ah! When the perfect comes, the imperfect disappears, and all that is left is bliss and happiness. Run with the vision, my son. Hold not back the words, for they are for this generation who stand before Yahweh in nearness, as did the generation when I was on earth. I will speak to my servants, the prophets, and you will not be alone with the vision. Laugh as when laughter catches you, unaware, for such is the way I will work in you, by surprise and immediacy. I will use you to win back peoples from the enemy, to touch souls from the dead with my life, and to bring them back to righteousness in me. Obedience is better than sacrifice, my son. For if you obey in me, your living sacrifice rises from the dead and is transformed, as it were, from one degree of glory to another. Until finally you are as me, holy, righteous, and pure, with love oozing from your soul in sweetness for others. Be still then and know that I am the Son of God and all creation, heaven and earth, will bow to me at my name, Yehoshua, or Jesus. Amen. So this was a word given back in 1990, um, back in 31st of October 1990, before I actually entered the land of Israel. It was in December the 20th, 1998, that I landed the land of Israel for seven years. Praise the name of Yehoshua. And I had my first child in Bethlehem. Amen. Yaakov be with you. May this word have been a blessing to you and encourage you to preach the word. Amen.